Corporations aren't people. Corporations are foreign powers. These corporate foreign powers have invaded America. They've taken over everything. They're eliminating competition, which is you. Your independent mind is something they want to take from you. If the FBI had plans to murder Occupy Wall Street founders and people who were uh, beginning the movement or trying to begin the movement, if the FBI was in cahoots with Wall Street, which is foreign powers and corporations, in planning sessions on picking targets, citizens who are exercising free speech, what does that say? It means that we pay taxes so that foreign powers get represented and they have uh, a, a secret army out there to take advantage of you. Uh, citizens, American citizens, can be murdered, spied on, ruined in behalf of foreign powers. Why should the FBI be able to have a uh, let's kill this American list? You know, why should there be a detention list? It's the corporations and the banks, foreign powers, that want to take out uh, independent minds and leaders who don't want a UN run United States. The UN is basically a front for offshore banks and, co and corporations. If it weren't, uh, would Israel be punished for things they are doing as far as uh, war crimes and would there be sanctions against Israel? If Israel can never be punished, then there's some sort of influence in the UN. If the CIA or NSA or FBI are never punished for uh, abusing the public, you know, it's it's every everybody's an individual. You can't say all police are bad, all FBI are bad. But if they're working to dismantle the U.S. Constitution, if they're breaking laws, if these these uh, operatives are kidnapping people, torturing people, making up stuff so people are in jail forever, or just straight up murdering people. Prior to 9-11, uh, state police, such as in Connecticut, had their own intelligence unit. They would set people up. They would go on uh, black ops. If you have a computer and you're using it to email elected officials, Maybe the, they had operatives to wreck your computer or spy on you. They were known to pay informants to beat people up, make false reports. Uh, paying informants to kill citizens. And then when it was find, found out and was on the news, uh, the officers weren't prosecuted. Officers, officers aren't prosecuted for rape. Prosecutors aren't. Uh, prosecuted for rape and when a uh, white probation officer had sex with mentally uh, unstable or or uh, mentally challenged young boys and then he, uh, he had sex with girls and other people that were un under uh, his probation this is in Connecticut this has been alleged to uh, hundreds of counts of rape and then you get probation and you get your full pension as a probation officer and credible sources have given me this information I'll, I'll, I'll give some uh, links with the video and as far as the FBI thing uh, the credible source I believe that that's something that they are doing you know do I have the papers in my hand no but it's a general trend we are occupied by corporations 
they want well why would, why would a prison corporation of America why would they want to uh, have a school shooting well if they're gonna get the contract to have private individuals get contracts to go into schools and go through school lockers looking for drugs they're a private army a foreign private army um, infiltrating the schools and if they're going to be the armed guards for schools prison corporation of America then schools are prisons so they're prison training training the kids to be in prison for actual prison which is the USA and it's all beyond disgusting they want to eliminate free speech they don't want you to ha have access to the internet to inform others they want to squash that they want to uh, take all guns from all Americans and Fourth Amendment are you secure in your uh, in your person and uh, your papers uh, police can just come to your house they can kidnap you in the middle of the night you can be tortured indefinitely detained even murdered and these mass murderers want to take all your guns take all your rights and make you happy that they're doing this if you watch MSNBC any of the major networks Fox News CNN your brain goes to mush you know flashing lights drum beats and why should you care what what foreign powers want you to want why shouldn't you have your, a mind of your own I think that if we had a United States wide or even worldwide sit down strike show these foreign powers that we're just not going to take it anymore you know the armed drones that they're flying over our heads here in America it's a war zone police are issued tanks so uh, we can't fight them fight this foreign power uh, on their turf we have to think outside the box to be free you know the, the US Constitution should mean something and you know we as Americans or everybody should have representation for their taxation you know we should feel have a feeling of safety and it's it's those who have taken over our government government that are terrorizing us and I'm assuming that like Sandy Hook school in Newtown I'm assuming that's a staged event it could be you know to a kid try to buy guns well it's actually an adult he plays violent video games perfect person to set up you know he's he's, he's already you know a known dumbass that's you know gonna be easy to uh, set up so you go in with operatives uh, you know kill the mother take her guns kill the son leave him on the uh, on the property with a uh, with, with a gunshot to the to his head and these shootings all have something in common they have you know wearing a mask and wearing a bulletproof vest so if the operatives you send in you know you can make whatever excuses you want after the fact so it, it looks fishy to me if, if corporations are gonna make billions why not have these false flags why not blow up uh, buildings uh, in the US why not kill people in mass shootings uh, and, and that would be the government that's doing that or their operatives and then they get what they want they disarm the people no free speech uh, we're uh, taking all your rights for your own safety you know how stupid are most of you out there I mean not you know there's a lot of people that are awake but you know just just give in to whatever the government says oh I, I saw it on CNN oh I saw it on Fox you know if you don't agree with George W Bush Bush you're uh, um, you know there's something wrong with you or if you don't agree with Obama there must be something wrong with you you know or O'Reilly and Fox News or wh wh whoever on whatever you know it's not conservative it's not liberative li uh, whatever <laughs> liberal these people are out to take all your rights no matter what label Republican Democrat 
they're bought and paid for by foreign powers they're not for you do something about it